there it's are just like so many people. Fun to be a part of this. <laughs> Man. We just checked out of our Airbnb and sadly today we are leaving Istanbul. We could have stayed here at least another week. This city is huge and so exciting and we loved our Airbnb. So we will link it below as well as the $40 off link if it's your first day. Today we are traveling to Cappadocia, which is the city I was most looking forward to visiting when we came here to Turkey and in tomorrow's video, you're gonna see why. But first we have a very, very long <laughs> travel day to get there. So today we're flying out of the airport where the budget airlines operate from, which is not quite as easy to get to as the airport that we flew into. It's actually on the Asian side of Istanbul. First we have to take a taxi to the bus station, then we have to take a bus to the airport, then we have to take the plane to Cappadocia, and then we have to take a, well, the plane doesn't actually go to Cappadocia. It goes to some city nearby. Then we take a shuttle to Cappadocia, and we're going to get there at some point tonight. So, step number one, find a taxi. We need to go to uh, Marmara Hotel in Taksim. That's the Marmara Hotel. Yes. Do you know? Okay. Thank you very much. So just across this way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So the taxi dropped us off in Taxim Square, which I believe is where the bus is supposed to pick us up to go to the airport. It was like six bucks, it went great. Ramada Hotel near the square and not the square. But it's okay, we found it. And as I see, we're headed to the airport. Our tickets are only 12 lira a person. We just realized that this bus went back over the bridge to the European side, where we just took a taxi from, and we're going to the wrong airport. Nate just went up to the front of the bus to talk to the driver. Hopefully we can stop and get our bags, get a taxi back over to the Asian side and the right bus. Uh, good thing we left early. We left early. We don't do that often. I think it's going to be okay. Alright, we're getting off here. We're getting off. Good luck. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So sorry. Well, that was really dumb. We are currently further away than where we originally started. We are going to jump on the metro, head back to the square, and get on the right bus this time, hopefully. I think it's just this big thing right here. Probably running with all those people. Subverted. We were back on the bus. They even let us use the same tickets that we purchased one hour ago. And now we're heading to the airport. We should be there like at least an hour and a half early. Thankfully, we had to check out of our Airbnb at 11, and we were like, we'll just go to the airport a little bit early, sit in the lounge. There won't be any time for that anymore, but we're going to make our flight. Airport. So 
still have an hour and a half to our flight. Wow, somehow we still need to lounge. It's time for a quick snack. All that tells me is that we originally left our Airbnb way too early this morning. This is a really pretty lounge with really good looking food, but I've decided I'm gonna try to fast today because I ate way too much yesterday. I've had so much bread and turkey. But right now I really wanna break my fast. I am still gonna drink coffee. Celebrating Ramadan. That was the last call. We are hustling to the gate. I'm pretty sure this is the cheapest flight that I've ever booked. We paid $28, including baggage, and I booked it two days before the flight. Crazy. P.S. That lounge was amazing. I mean, I can't say anything about the food. I didn't need <laughs> any. But we've had some really good priority pass lounges lately. <laughs> So we have pre-booked a shuttle for about six dollars a piece that's going to take us the rest of the way to Cappadocia. We're just waiting on the rest of the group to show up. It's all right. Like we just drove into another planet. This is like the coolest landscape that I have ever seen. But we did have a little bit of a catastrophe on the way. Oh, my my backpack's ever broke. Everything is over. It's crazy. We've been carrying these bags for the past year and a half. Kara's zipper broke about a week and a half ago, so that's why she's carrying a new backpack. And then mine broke. We should have gotten you one just too. A few days later. But it's this, okay. This right here, oh, all my stuff just fell out of my bag. This little rock castle thing right here, this is where we're staying tonight. In, I think they're called fairy castles? Fairy the rocks chimney. are it's called fairy, fairy chimney. chimneys. Like our place is literally called Pretty Fairy Chimney. And we are just in a valley that is filled with these beautiful fairy chimneys. And we're in the road and all of my stuff is. Close one. Mm, I hate this. This is one of the coolest Airbnbs we've ever stayed in. It's inside of the earth. We're staying in a cave. It's a cave inside of a mountain. It's all just been carved out of this rock. It's the coolest and it smells really good. There's not a very good view because we're inside of a rock, but upstairs the view is so good. Look at this place. 
It's like we're on another planet. And this, this is what we're staying inside of. We're gonna watch the sunset and call it a night because tomorrow morning we have a very early wake up call. We are getting picked up at 4.05 a.m. for a hot air balloon ride over Cappadocia. So we're gonna get some sleep tonight in the vlog early, but before we do, we almost forgot to tell you a really fun story. So yesterday was the first day of Ramadan and during Ramadan, everybody fasts for the entire day and then in the evening, they all gathered together in the square by the Blue Mosque to have their first meal. So we just had to go check it out. <laughs> Everybody is right now. And it is very loud. They have huge speakers and there's a cannon. Like we don't have a cannon. Two cannons. Two cannons. Two cannons. Two cannons. Two cannons. Everybody has food on the table. I'm just sitting there looking at it, waiting to eat. I'm pretty sure as soon as the evening call to prayer starts, that's when everybody can dig in. I think it's going to be a really exciting moment. <laughs> shoot off the cannon. Nate and I separated. He's over with the people eating and I came to the cannon because I love cannons. And I think they're going to shoot it. This is crazy. Please do not panic. Wow! That was crazy! Wow! The cannon going off was crazy. I could feel it in my body. Body. <laughs> Never seen anything like that before. I really thought as soon as the cannon went off, everybody was gonna be like, oh my god, because that's exactly what I would have done if I hadn't eaten all day. But it was much more calm than I expected. Everybody just like nicely opened their box and started eating their food. They're playing this really pleasant music. It's basically like a citywide picnic in a city of 15 that million people. <laughs> Cute. We're gonna end the vlog a little early, but <laughs> sorry. This new hat stole me off. <laughs>